Interesting. Oh, <laughs> very interesting. What's going on YouTube, Corporate Slacker, with another Destiny video? So a quick follow-up to my Zer video this week. I bought five legendary engrams. Some of the new TTK legendary engrams. And I decrypted them. You saw that in my Zer video. I just want to go over one of them in particular that uh, we haven't seen yet. Uh, and it's new for the Warlock class. So uh, if you saw my last video, you'll see I got two stags, two obsidian mines and a Celestial Nighthawk. This is going to be great for my Hunter, I'll move it over in the Vault, and uh, when I start him, he'll be able to, to rock that pretty early on. Got the uh, Obsidian Mines, uh, same as Year 1, just brings it up to a Year 2 spec. Uh, looks like this one has better stats on it, just bigger intellect, so I'm going to go ahead and get rid of this one. Uh, I'll take the Exotic Shard, ready for when uh, I need to build something from Blueprints. Uh, but for the real thing, for why this video exists, I got the stag. I got two of them actually, uh, so I'm very lucky. A little sad that it was duplicates twice, but uh, I can't complain. Uh, looks like, yeah, looks like uh, this one here has a little bit better stats on that intellect, so we're going to go ahead and get rid of this one. But on to the video the stag it looks epic very much like the ram uh, many of you remember the ram from house of wolves it was a pain in the crucible with that extra armor but we have now got the stag which seems to follow the same kind of theme of animal skulls pretty cool but let's get into the specs oh dear goodness okay well played, Bungie. Play on your words. But, the specs. Doe or die. Once per life, your supercharge is faster when your teammates are dead. Chance to respawn with an overshield. That's quite nice. I can see a... Uh, that might be good in uh, some PvE uh, aspects. You know, you die. You, know, you drop. It happens. Uh, you get revived by a teammate. And you... Uh, uh, you get your uh, overshield from them, uh, or if you just respawn without them, which uh, obviously happens, you know, you don't want to risk it, you might also get that overshield. So it's a win-win situation. You have an overshield both times. I know you get the overshield uh, upon revives anyway. This is just a nice option on respawn to, to, to get that as well. Usual stats here, intellect, strength. Um, you pick which one you want. Uh, spec it to what you need at the time. Usually for me it's intellect, uh, ashes to assets, gain bonus super energy on grenade kills, heavy lifting, gain bonus super energy from heavy weapon kills on minions of the darkness. Um, uh, not bad. Obviously a PvE um, spec. Uh, I think I'll prefer this. I throw a lot of grenades, so I could probably use that a little bit more, but we'll try both of them. And the last one better already shields start recovery immediately after orb pickup this seems to be a theme on many items in uh, ttk but there you go people that is the stag exotic warlock helmet and it looks pretty beastly with it on i'm gonna rock that for a while for sure let me know how you think of it uh in the comments leave a like let's try and get this video up to uh, uh 50 likes that'd be great uh, share it with your friends, and until next time, Corporate Slacker out.